Alright, what's up YouTube? This is Can't Snipe. I'm, today I'm going to show you how to download your um, file manager so you can copy over patches over on your PS3 and start doing lobbies. First, you're going to click the thing in my, in my description, the link. You'll get this, this web page with those three things. You need to click download each one. Okay, and you want to just come. And you want to hit click here to download. Okay? And then you want to click the save button. Okay, and then it'll load up. Hit close. Alright, now you can exit out of that one. Go to the second one. Download. You want to do the same thing for all three of these. Wait for it to start loading up. Alright, click right there to start downloading. Same thing, you guys. Okay. Almost done. Now the last one. I'm going to click download on it. And do the same exact thing as the other two. Start download. Save. Okay, just wait for it. This one takes a little more. Two seconds, three seconds more. Close it. Alright, now you can close both of the internet pages. Out. Alright. Now what you want to do is you want to get your USB flash drive and you want to put it in your computer. Mine's already in my computer. Alright, and you want to open that up. Okay. What you want to do is you want to take this right here. The awesome file manager. You want to put that one right on the front page. Okay, so right when you open it up, that's where that one should be. And then you need to make a folder called PS3. You need to open that up and you need to make a folder called MW2 Patches. And then you want to open that up. Oh, hold on. Now what you want to do is you want to get the patch MPFF and you want to put it in that MW2 Patches folder. And the same thing patches with File Manager. Just like that. Now you can close that out and the computer part is done. Now you want to take your USB out of here and plug it in to your PS3. Now, I already have both of them, but I do want to show you guys. Now you want to go to install package files right there. After you jailbroke, your PS3 needs to be jailbroken. You'll see it. You want to click X and download it. And you want to go down. After it's done loading, you will get this. You want to click X on this. This part is very important. You do not want to mess it up. Alright, you'll get this page right there. Looks very, very weird. You want to go over to the right side only using D pad. You want to click right on the D pad and go down all the way to dev underscore usb right there in the bottom one you want to click on it you want to go to the ps3 right there you want to just hit ps3 and click x on it you'll see both of these you want to go to the mw2 patches folder okay now you want to get the patch mpf at Make sure the little thing's on it. Now what you want to do is you want to click left on the D-pad. It'll bring you over here. You want to go all the way down to the HDDO. Right there. Dev HDDO. You want to click it. Now you want to go all the way to the game directory. Okay? You'll see it? Go all the way to game and click X. You'll get this. Alright. These are the name of your games. This is how you find out the games right here. Right there on, on each side of the game, they'll see a BUS, B-U-S, with a number. They're all different. They'll say something. But what you want to do is match up whatever game you, you're putting the patch on. So right now, I am, I'm doing Modern Warfare 2. And my thing is BUS, B-U-S, 33, I mean 3377. So I want to look for that one, and it's the first one for me. So I want to go over there. I want to click X. Now, you want to click the US 
rdir directory you want to click that you're going to see this right there patch mpf you'll notice that's the same thing as that one over there they're the same thing now what you want to do is you want to copy it mine's already copied so i'm not going to do it once it's copied you'll be done and what you want to do is you want to hit the home button and you want to quit the game All right. and I am going to have a video of how to put an FTP server on there Okay. And then all basically you just start your game up let it load. Mine takes a little while to get it going up there. My house is pretty messy. Yeah, right? Just skip all this good stuff. Alright there, you just want to hit start. Go to multiplayer. Alright. It's very, very simple. You should get that. Just just looks all normal. Play online. Do pri I'm doing private match right now just to show you guys. Then you don't gotta change nothing. You you can change the game rules if you want. It's whatever you want. Change your map. Put your settings however you want. But I'm just gonna show you this for now. All right, just start it up. All right, you're not your classes aren't going to be colored. My, I have this patch right. You can do whatever you want. You can give yourself God mode. You get the links up there. God mode, bot, super jump, and squares to get out of this menu. All right, you guys. It's very very simple. Uh, I'd be playing, um, doing challenge lobbies all the time with the friends, having fun. There's a lot of things you can do. The weirdest stuff. You get infinite ammo, just have fun. Infections, all this stuff you can do once you do that. And that's basically it. That's how you get to host a challenge lobby, you guys.